It's time for a little TOL action. We're all the way into week 12. And there you saw the star for the drunkards, Bill Murray, the hero himself, trots out of the hospital and goes directly to the game. He even spent all hospital in his pads. I appreciate that. They're going up against the Liquid Swords. Liquid Swords struggling a little bit. I think they're 21 in the power rankings. The drunkards coming in at 10, an impressive 7-3 and three record although a relatively small 11-point differential given that. So the Drunkards clinging to a lead in their division. A very tight division with EAS and a couple of other people thrown in there. So we shall see what happens. It's a handoff to Woods, who takes a nice little drive. Picks up seven, second and three. Motion again. This time they decide to throw. He's got his man open, and he's going to lead him just a little too far. Bryce is there. They're going to go more conservative with the run play. And look at him go. He looks like he's doing pretty well there, moving pretty quick and also strong. And that's another first down on the FB open to the far side. They've got their tight end across the middle. They may just choose to run. They do. He avoids a couple of guys. Picks up eight and a half. They may try that same play again. No, this time they're going to do this sweep. What's he going to do? Oh, ref, ref, it's a backward throw, ref. But somehow they weren't paying attention and they blew the whistle. Now here comes the run play. Sometimes gets stuffed, but if you can hit that outside, it's not too bad. And they do. First and ten. They've been able to pick up each of their first downs on the run, yet to complete a pass. He's going to fire it into coverage. Double coverage. The man peeled off the corner. Nice move there. Going to pass again. He's got his tight end wide open. Willie set his feet. He decides to run again. The run's been working, but not that time. Just a yard. A big third and nine now. And everybody's covered. He's got maybe the tight end. He's going to find Diggs, who makes a couple of nice moves to avoid some people, and gets all the way down to the 23. I think that's actually wide receiver two, my bad. Now he's got to dump it up to Woods. He hits him in stride, so he is running. Look at the moves of this kid. In and out of people to find the end zone. Corey Woods spikes the ball, races over, and gives his mom a kiss. Gary Grice is there, pumping fists, throwing elbows. Plenty of time. And they don't get in. So 7 nothing after a nice steady drive. A long third down. They were able to convert. And now Mann fires it to the far side. Deep, deep for Punk. Two and a half yards inside his own end zone. Runs over a man in his haste to pick up the yardage. Still working. Gets out to the 25. Let's see if they're going to try to feed their star receiver. They are with the reverse. Looks like he's got a fair amount of green, but it closes relatively quickly. He's not feeling super impressive, but it doesn't seem to matter. He finds the inside, then finds the outside. Look at Ackroyd. Pick up speed. Somehow works through that whole play. Now it's four wide. They've got him on their heels. Who knows what's going on? He's got a quick dump off. He's got a deep strike. He decides to go to Ramos. It's got to be too much. Ramos leaped, but the 30-inch vertical, not enough to get the former Ghostbuster up into the air and catch that ball. They go back to what worked for him. This time they try the blitz. They've got a couple people all around, but Ackroyd is just fast enough to pick up the first. So it looks like that play is going to collapse around him, but he somehow keeps finding green. This time, Bill Murray's going to do the quick dump off to Choice Piece. Oh, Choice Piece almost scooched her cute little butt into the end zone, but she picks up a first and goal looking to tie this game. Bill Murray says, I'm not going to bother throwing it down, and he just races up and scores. And we've got a rowdy crowd behind me, folks, but they are excited for the home team. See what kind of defense they can do. A man gets tossed. He's almost in the screen, and it is shot. So just like that, a touchdown from the Drunkards. It's a 7-7 battle. That ate, up, that ate up almost the entire first quarter. Here comes Jones. He's got some speed. If he can stay in a straight line, he's going to hit the outside. A nice diving tackle prevents a huge gain. But well job getting out to the 37. 
A job well done. Again, he finds Woods. Woods immediately hits the sideline. Cannot quite sprint past his guy. Had a lane if he could find it, but it's still a 13-yard pickup. Oh, he's got somebody deep. Can he stay focused? There's a lot of noise. There's a lot of distraction, but he's going to fire it out of bounds. Greasy could not handle it. That's going to piss some people off. The man peels off. He's running right into a guy. What a diving throw and catch. He lofted it just over the leaping defender into the outstretched hands. Check that out. And again, oh, but that time the defender dove perfectly, got his head around, and knocked that ball out. This play has worked for him before. They've got Diggs if they want it. Diggs is there. He's sprinting to the end zone, and then he will not be stopped. He hurls someone not known for his strength, but he must have done a quick move. Robert Diggs did a spin move through the guy to the ground, and Gary Gracie there. And it's been nothing but TDs. You strike, I strike, you strike back. And we're looking at a 14-7 game. No punts, no field goals, no turnovers. This is some high-quality offense. Punk now fields it from inside the end zone there. This time he hits the wide side. Doing a great job using the entire field. Look at him go. And out to the 48. What a return for CM Punk. And he is saying suck it to everybody. Big call play. He is going to get the ball off. Fires it down. Could we get a jump or a dive? It's into double coverage incomplete. Ultimately lucky to get the ball off. Here comes the reverse. Let's see how they play it this time. They're kind of shifting out of position. Ackroyd's got some green. They're trying to close fast. He gets a couple of divers. He makes some nice moves. Makes a lot of guys miss. Will anybody get him? And they finally bring him down at the four. The reverse is killing them, and here they go running again. Oh, but this time he gets tied up, and for the first time, the reverse, they read it well. I was a little distracted there. And he got tied up but right as he pitched off the ball. Choice piece following her blockers. She does get tied up. The blocker did not do a good job engaging. Just back to third and four. Here comes reverse. Let's see what they do here. Oh, and it's Reikimon, I believe, or somebody. No. Oh, and then he fumbles. It's a horde, but who's caught it? Baxton Jones. I think one of the linemen picks it up. What a play. And so they are going to be held to a field goal. Despite a first and goal from the four, the defense stiffened for the swords. And Butthead trots out, and it's blocked. It's a blocked kick. The drunkards recover, preventing a big return, but unable to do anything with the ball. Wow. What a couple of turn of events there. And now he's got a couple of choices. Terrible throw into a man with his feet set. Couldn't be luckier that it was not, in, not picked off. They try the same play again. Why? I don't know. It didn't work well the first time. This results in a sack from the legend, the measuring stick himself. Now they're in trouble. I don't like motion here on my own end zone. They try to feed it to him quick, but all he can do is basically fall down behind a defender and burn off a few seconds. So the drunkards will get the ball, likely in good field, good position. It's a decent kick. They put some pressure on, trying to set up a bit of a return. The blockers hold nicely. So Punk stands at his 38, quickly is going to advance to his 50, make it at the 40. Coming across, will we have a punt return for a TD? We will not, but it is already in field goal range, and they've got two plays to further advance the ball. He's going to go deep, a lot of pressure in his face. Ackroyd is there, but he's a man. He's trying to make up for the fumble. Caught in coverage back at the four. 21 seconds, though. They're going to have to settle for a field goal. That wrestle burned up some valuable clock, and this time Beavis takes his time. Fires it all the way down for good old Kevin. Check out the size of my butt hit. Jones has some speed, so I don't know if he's got a miracle in him. He does not. So they're going to need, they've got one or two plays that can do a deep, deep strike. This is probably not it. They are going to find him, but unless he can just get a magic score, 
This will give him some nice yardage here, but will not do anything else. He needed the lateral of that as he was running. Chose not to, wanted the glory for himself, and it cost his team. So, wow, the pace has settled down a little bit, but still strike after strike. Big defensive stand from the Liquid Swords to hold them to three, and then a black, actually nothing. But they were able to get that ball quick and turn right back around. Big tackle there, and now the Drunkards start with their worst field position of the day. Trips to the near side. Murray is there. A lot of pressure. He's going to find the open man, Frank Lloyd Wright. Look at him drive that DeLorean down the street. And he picks up 20 yards because of it. This play worked is what they scored a touchdown on. But it's pretty well read. Murray held to five. Now it's an offset formation for Murray. Called play, though. Choice piece doesn't have much. She actually does a decent job just getting back to the line of scrimmage. Huge third down here. Will they turn it over? Going to have somebody deep. Oh, but the D lineman gets his hands up and knocks it down. That had the potential for a big strike. Maynard of the Saints is going to fire it a bit too deep. And that's too bad because they would have stopped any kind of return there. So let's see if they can get back to that steady run play. He stumbles a bit. Coming out. Dangerous throw. Greasy barely even had a hand on it. They really need to do more runs. That's been working well. Let's see what this does. Gets a couple of blocks. That's a nice pickup. Third and two now. Very manageable. They want to keep that ball. Keep moving those chains. Will he be able to hit the outside? He will not. And that play costs them and costs them big time. So all they're going to do is a three and out and a quick punt right back to the drunkards clinging to that four-point lead. They at least free up a few blockers. Punk is there. He's got some speed. He blows over someone, but a big tackle there, a sure-footed, wrapped-up, double-foot tackle. Here's the toss to choice piece. She's going to have a fair amount of green as she hits that near side. And finally it collapses, but not after she crosses the chains. Ten and a half yard breakaway for Tiffany. Murray's trying to fade. There's someone at his feet. He's got a chance for Ramos. Will he get the jump? Oh, no. He got the dive and it fell just a little short. Second and ten. Here comes Murray on the sweep, but they sniffed it out. And he will lose five. Third and 15. Suddenly these offenses are grinding down. They're going to try that same play. The defense is not fooled. And Murray picks up one yard for his trouble. Schmedium punt. I think he'll have a chance to return. Maynard does have some extra hitting power, but it doesn't matter. Jones is at the 10. Desperate to get to the 20. And that's exactly where he's brought down. Double back set. They like this formation. They've got the dump off. That RB2 is pretty slow. Can he get it to him? There's a man there. Blocked. Blocked. He tried to line it up. The soft pitch was too short. Lucky it wasn't picked. This time they try that run again. He blows by somebody. Look at him hit the outside now to the 50. Gets a diver. And all the way down to the 37. So that play has been hit or miss that time. They hit. He's going to try to lead Woods. Does. But he's immediately brought down. Three yard pickup. He's got his tight end. Got a lot of pressure. Oh, he freaked out. When the large creature known as the measuring stick is in your face. Angry and frothing. With jerky hanging out of his mouth. All you can do is basically just take a knee and pray to the gods. And now Brad Peck is there, and suddenly a drive that looked oh so promising stalls at 4th and 23. Not even a chance for a field goal. They'll fire it too deep. Punk will not get a chance. So 34 seconds left in the third. Drunkards take off at the 20. Fair amount of time. He just wanted to distract him with the receivers. Bill Murray looking pretty fast. Gets a diver. Got a couple of chasers here. 
And one of them sticks with it, but a massive gain for the drunkards. All the way down to the 31. Here comes some pressure. Oh, they bite up on the near side. Ramos is there, and he cannot jump. Oh, if only he didn't have the Ghostbusters pack on, it cost him in his vertical. Man at his feet. Ackroyd. Oh, they went to the well once too often, and Coles with a massive INT. And Li Liquid Swords once again hold strong as they near their own end zone. Let's see what they do here. This time he's going to try to flee. And does it actually turn to nothing into a tiny something? Then we'll call that a good play. Second and six. He's going to keep it himself. He's going to have a lot of pressure. That arm is not going to get going. And he will lose the six that he, the four that he fought for. And it's actually third and 11 from people. <laughs> Here comes this play again, but that outside linebacker able to shed his man. The chop blocker went in too soon there. And so once again, it's a punt. All they can do is try to play the field position game. Digital fires it down. Pretty good kick. Very good kick. Punk at the four. He's got a lot of guys there, but he's able to get around all of them. All of a sudden, he's got the D spread. That blocker hurls one of the fastest guys. Look at Punk go! He gets a diver brought down at the 42. So they punted to play the field position game, and Punk said, no siree. Let me show you how this is done. Oh, but Ackroyd now brought down. They're starting to cue in on some of their best plays. They've adapted to the reverse. Let's see what they do here. They cover the deep guy. They've got one man open. It's a perfect throw. He had to throw it right there for Ramos. And he did. Ramos at the 20. Ramos at the 13. First down. Can the drunkards take the lead here? 229 left. Each team will possess the ball at least one more time. There's a lot of pressure. It's a jumping catch. Choice piece makes a great play. The man was in the position. He thought for sure he was going to pick it. But no, Choice Piece grabs it. Then they're going to try to give her that well-earned touchdown. She's going to avoid the blocker and does score. Look at her jump up and down. Look at the buttocks move nicely. There it is. And they take the lead here. First time they've had the lead with two and a half minutes left less than. And it's a three-point game. Wishing they had had that other field goal. Deep, deep kick, though. Nice kick to Jones. Way deep, four yards from his end zone. Got a lot of guys there. Oh, he ticks the wrong line. He had to head up. He head down. He went down instead. Got nervous and they're only at the 12. Long way to go. Uh-oh, they've left a the man open. Will they get the ball off? They do. Smith fires. Clifford Smith is catches from Greasy. He's at the 40. Gets a diver. 30. Has a chaser and brought down at the 22. And just like that, they're in field goal position. Can the drunkards defense hold or will they collapse like the drunk bums that they are? They've got a fair amount of green here. Woods is striving. Oh, almost picked up his feet, but a huge 11-yard pickup. Field goal almost guaranteed now. Double back set. What are they going to do? They're going to need a pick if they're going to go for it. Can he get it? But he cannot. Jason Hunter with a TD strike to take the lead. And Gary Grice fires it down. I don't care. Greasy, Gracie, whatever the fuck you are. We're going. This, this kick will be good. They doink it in. A field goal will not tie. Gigantic kick. He's fired up. They're going to send Punk four yards deep in the end zone. He's going to bring it out. First wave there, but gets met. And they're at the eleven. Can they do what we just saw? Can they drive 89 yards for a TD strike? Throwing an INT is not the way to go. Lucky it was back to, batted away by the offender. Some pressure. They get it off to Choice Piece, who's been a hero here late. She's making moves. But time, a very strong factor. 35 yards, 35 seconds. And a lot more than that to go. They're covering the deep men. They got to be content with the check down. Lloyd Wright picks up another 15, but this pace is not enough. 18 seconds, one or two plays left. 
They've got to send someone deep. I think they're going reverse. Oh no, they're betting it all on the reverse right here. Can Ackroyd be the hero? The time is out. He needs to score and he will not. He will not. And the drunkards fall just short. And suddenly that narrow, narrow lead they had in their division is swept away. As they lose to the swords and they're back in the middle of the pack. Who the hell knows what's going to happen now. This thing just blew wide open. Thanks for spending time.